It marks 100 years since the Great Fire of New Bern that happened on December 1st, 1922. It started in the early morning hours, and this was the view from the Alks building at downtown New Bern looking north. 50 mile an hour winds helped spread that fire. More than 900 homes were destroyed, most of which had wood shingles at the time. More than 3,000 people were left homeless and ended up living in a tent city. New Bern's Fireman uh, Museum tour guide Mike Markham says the Great Fire spurred a lot of change in the colonial capital. They didn't have a lot of fire codes back in those days and stuff. Obviously, the metal roofs that you see on houses, that was one of the outcomes. Uh, they had metal roofs on here and stuff. So they started taking you know, more fire codes, safety concerns and stuff. But it really started to put a, uh, a, a quotation marks around having better equipment and better codes and stuff to go by. And you can learn more about the Great Fire of New Bern at the Firemen's Museum. They have an entire display dedicated to the fire on their second floor.